Hey, good evening, good evening, good evening. I'm going to work on the little mixer here real quick. But thank you, everyone, for uh, coming out this evening for the... Oh my goodness, the 8th uh, Bracket Battle. This is number 8. This is going to be the Alt Art Edition. So we're kind of in a lull. No new set. Next month, Lost Origin. We're going to be hunting that Giratina Alt Art. But until then, this week we are... This month we are taking a look back at all of the greatest Alt Art sets to have come out this past year. Alt Art's one of the best things that they've really leaned into over the past year. So as people jump on in here, we've got Battle Styles tonight, Chilling Rain, we got Astral, we can go after the Dialga Palkia, we got Brilliant Stars, get the Charizard, Arceus, all the goodies out of there, Chilling Rain, oh my goodness, you got the birds in that one, you got Celebi, uh, Blissey, Rapidash, Zeraora, Pawns in there, Fusion Strike, somebody could go home tonight with the, the Gengar, the Mew, the Inteleon, that Espeon, Oh, and we got the daddy of all the alt art sets, Evolving Skies, with that uh, Rayquaza VMAX, Umbreon VMAX, Glaceon, Sylveon, Leafeon, all the goodies. All the goodies. That's what we're ripping tonight. We're going to mix these all up here. Uh, and then in addition, in addition to that, we're going to choose... We're going to shuffle these. I got uh, four cards from each of the sets we're ripping tonight. Uh, and these are going to be wild cards. Uh, so each set's going to have a wild card bounty. And then if you pull that bounty, you're going to select from one of four alt arts that I got here from these sets this evening. So we got four alt arts you get to choose from if you pull one of the bounty cards. So... Uh, Look out for that. It's not necessarily. You don't have to pull pull the alt art yourself. You can certainly do that. But we're going to be doing uh, some bounties. So it's going to be a couple of V's, character rares, uh, things like that. V maxes, a lot of the lower level cards, amazing rares. That are going to be uh, be the bounty that we're chasing for each uh, each one of these sets here. Here we'll take the lichen rock out of that one. Picked about four cards per set, so nothing too crazy. So usually two V's and two V Max is a set. So once some folks get in here, we're going to uh, start pulling those, and then we're going to start shuffling up the packs, load up our uh, pack slots, and then we're going to get after it here. We're going to get to uh, figuring out who's going to win pack battle number eight uh winner of this goes on to the end of year uh giveaway as well as well as uh four folks at the end we're gonna do a little wheel spin uh and then four of those folks are also gonna end up in that end of year stream all the mid-year folks carried over so this is the uh next five out of the 30 uh and then like i said next month we're going to be doing Lost Origin. Uh, we're going to do that uh, release weekend. Uh, I need to look on the calendar. I believe that's like mid, mid-September. mid I think that's about two weeks from now, I want to say. So we're going to be doing a Lost Origin release weekend. Uh, so get that. Lots of good alt arts again in that set. Uh, as well as a new uh, character rare uh, subset. And lots of goodies. Uh I think there's going to be a few more Radiants. Uh, there's at least a Sneasler. I know there's a Sneasler because I have the Japanese one. So, keep an eye out for that. I'll be posting that on the Illinois Pokestock Discord. That's where you can find myself. Uh, in addition to here on Twitch and the Discord, you can find me on Whatnot. And other major outlets. If you want to... Instagram, TikTok, all the goodies. I'm going to be at Upgrade at all of those. So 
Again, here at Upgrade, at Upgrade, everywhere else. Nice and easy. If it's Upgrade spelled by Chris, it's me. Check out what I'm posting. I'm usually hanging out, ripping cards, painting models, sorting stuff, dropping off some tips and tricks on how I do my day to day. Run my little Pokemon businesses online and other collectibles and keep building my collection. So, thanks again. We're going to get the wheel set up here while we wait for a few more people here to jump in at the top of the hour. Uh, and then we're going to start uh, picking the bounty cards here from each of these sets. We're going to get the packs shuffled and then we're going to start ripping here. Uh, probably about quarter after, so eight minutes from now. Uh, we're gonna start the rip. We usually give folks about 15 minutes to uh, to load up here But yeah, thanks again for joining this evening and uh, Looking forward hoping we uh, rip at least a couple alt arts or at the very least Somebody pulls one of these bounty cards uh, and gets a pick from the alt art pile In the meantime sit back relax enjoy Enjoy a little lo-fi girl. Compliments of YouTube because I don't want my YouTube video of this stream, which I post right after. So if you miss it, this will be posted up to YouTube. You're going to watch it in its entirety. But uh, if I play any other music, the <laughs> the stream gets pulled down. So we're listening to lo-fi. Wheel of Names. I don't know where my iPad is, so we're going to do Wheel of Names on the PC. Okay, I'm feeling generous. I'm going to up the pile to five. There's five mystery alt arts this evening. So these are obtainable by pulling the bounty card here. Once a few more folks get in here, we can have a little fun game with numbers where we can do little shuffles and we can, uh, we can pick what our bounty cards are going to be this evening. And those bounties, now the first five bounties hit, uh, is going to pay out a alt art. Lots of good things though. Lots of returners. Couple uh, folks I haven't seen in a little bit back out. So exciting stuff this evening. So let's put these, the bounties, to the side. Let's start uh, shuffling the packs here. I'm like making a layer cake. Sprinkle some evolving skies. Evolving skies showing up everywhere. Get to your local Costco. They got them uh, evolving skies ETBs right now in a bundle for uh, a solid $37.99. You get an ETB and 
a tin. Uh, I think there's a mutant. Most of it's those e, uh, evolution tins that were out uh, during Evolving Skies right about then. I don't know if the current tins are packaged with con with Evolving Skies, so there are two, uh, two versions of that, but if you're on the Discord, Feel free to jump into the uh, the tins and UPC. Uh, somebody might have it posted on uh, which versions of those are. I think the newer ones have brilliant stars in them instead of uh, brilliant stars in them instead of evolving skies. But uh, yeah, there was a, a time when those evolution tins came with evolving skies, uh, and then I think there's a mute tin. I forget what comes in those. I think chilling rain. Vivid Voltage, and maybe Battle Styles. Battle Styles probably comes in one of them, no doubt. These evolving skies broken up. Was it 62? So 31 in each. Eight. I said a number and I forgot what the first stack was. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 31. Here we go. And then 31 should be here. We're going to load up the dispensers here. Again, we're going to be working Battle Styles, Fusion Strike, Chilling Rain, Evolving Skies, Brilliant Stars, and Astral Radiance. We're going to we're gonna rip the cycle here of alt art. So if it has an alt art in it, we're ripping it this evening. Uh, and then the prizes here, we'll get... You might ask, if you're a regular, you might ask, why don't you pull out the 10 packs for the prizes? Oh. Rest assured, the prizes have already been pre-selected. There we go. We got these fantastic 3D printed card holders. If you're interested, let me know. I know some of the prints these. They're real nice. Real nice quality and they're not going to be a uh, million dollars like uh, most folks have been selling these things for. At the very least, if you have your own printer, you might see if they would uh, sell you the uh, the file for a couple bucks that they designed for me. But great stuff. So prizes this evening. First prize is going to get themselves five packs of Evolving Skies. Here's the uh, the alt art theme this evening. So five packs of Evolving Skies going to first place. The set with the second most. Alt Arts. Chilly Rain. I know. False. <laughs> Brilliant Star says the next best set of Alt Arts. I've reversed that. So Brilliant Stars, three packs of Brilliant Stars going to second place. And then third and fourth are going to be getting a Chilling Rain pack. So that is, again, first, second, third and fourth. So those are the packs this evening. All the prizes, we can uh, rip the packs at the end. So, again, as a quick recap uh, on how the game is played. So we're going to rip two packs. It's going to be a mix of packs. But thanks for you to the card rank system now, uh, we can do things like this versus some of the uh, the first ones when we uh, looked at card cost or value. Now we can do a mix of uh, sets now we're doing this. So... Two trainers, each are going to get a pack. We're going to open it up. We're going to look at the rare slot. The only exception to that is going to be either a Radiant being pulled or uh, if there is the tie, tiebreaker, 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 then we're just going to slot, go to the, the reverse slot. But we'll get to that. So 
two folks are each going to rip a pack. Uh, the higher rare slot or radiant uh, that you gets pulled uh, is the winner or loser uh, is finished. Everyone gets to keep their cards. Uh, it's not a winner takes all scenario here. We're going to come in here. Tiebreaker is the higher HP for Pokemon uh, if you get two full arts or two V-stars. One with the higher HP is going to win. Uh, and for trainers, it's the alphabetical order uh, closest to the letter A. The tiebreaker tiebreaker. The Pokemon then goes to alphabetical order. The trainer's second letter in the name closest to A. Uh, so if you had uh, Professor's uh, Research and Peony, uh, it would be Peony since it's uh, an E. Uh, and then in the event that the same rare slot card is pulled, you know, if we have two battle styles and you each pull a Tyranitar V, we're then going to go to the reverse slot, uh, and then we're going to go back to higher HP than alphabetical, and so on and so forth. So that is how the game is played. Let's get everything here on camera. Perfect. Uh, now we're going to pull what our bounty cards are this evening so we're gonna shuffle each one up and we're gonna pull our bounties if anyone's in chat feel free to shout out a number or anything like that while we're picking these so for the brilliant stars bounty it's going to be the mimikyu v max okay so we're hunting for the mimikyu v max on all brilliant stars For battle styles, we're looking between the Necrozma V, Tyranitar V, Flapple, and Urshifu V Max. So let's get these all, all shuffled, 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 shuffled. Okay, let's go. First one the Urshifu V Max, two V Maxes. For our bounties thus far. And the old battle styles, pal. Okay, for Fusion Strike, we're looking at Greedent V, Genesect V, Gengar V Max, and Mew V Max. Oh, geez, one of these is in. Let me uh, redo that. I thought they were all in. The same sleeve. Hold, please. Not to fear. We'll keep the Mew VMAX. But. You know what? We'll toss in a V. We'll make Fusion Strike an, an easy hitter. We'll, uh, or a chance at getting it. So let's flip these back. Gengar VMAX. You know what? Executive decision. We're going to go with one of the Vs. There we go. Cinderace V. I want some folks to go away with some alt arts this evening. Fusion. Chilling rain. These are the fusion pile. Perfect. Sorry, I got a pile. I'm trying to put these back in once they're done. Okay, from here we got the Decidui VMAX, a Radiant Greninja, Word Deer, or Origin Form. Palkia. Whoops, how we doing? We are selecting our bounty cards this evening. Let's go far left. Radiant Greninja. Radiant Greninja is going to be our next. Next up is Evolving Skies. So we're going to shuffle the old Evolving Skies up. And too many V Maxes. I tried to make it Vs. 
Let's pick some V's. <laughs> okay, we're going between these two. There we go. SP on V. We already picked too many V maxes. I'm not. Okay, and last we got the Articuno V, Calyrex, Celebi, and Blaziken. Shuffle them up. Shuffle them up. And the Articuno V. Okay. So we got our bounties. There we are. Okay. So, anybody just jumping in here. So, tonight, the name of the game is Alt Arts. Uh, these are the representatives of the six sets that we're ripping tonight. If anyone pulls any of these six cards, we'll just uh, put these back here. Anybody pulls any of these six cards, well, then you're going to get a chance to pull for one of these five alt arts. So not only can you pull an art, alt art out of the actual packs, if you pull any of those, uh, you can actually pick from the stack of five alt arts here. Yes, five different alt arts. Just making sure. Okay, let's uh, toss these over here. And let's uh, let's kick it off. Uh, and again, what we're playing for tonight: first place gets you five packs of Evolving Skies. Second place gets you three of Brilliant Stars. And then third and fourth, we're gonna be playing for some Chilling Rain. Uh, in addition to all the other goodies and chances at winning. So it's 9:23. Let's get her kicked off. We'll turn the music down a little bit, because I'm sure people want to hear my lovely voice for a radio. Okay. Well, here we go. Starting off this eighth bracket battle, we got Muskie versus Juan. Muskie just coming off the win last month, the Pokemon Go. So as we're going to do, uh, like usual, left side is going to pull out of the black container. Right is going to pull out of the white. You get those. If you 3D print these, make sure you put the slot in the back or else uh, they're always going to be stuck. So this is the bottom one. This is Muskie's pack. We got a mix here of Chilling Rain, uh, Fusion Strike, Battle Styles, Evolving Skies, Brilliant Stars, and Astral Radiance that we're ripping tonight. So we're going to see a, a ton and probably a couple cross, uh, cross set uh, things, uh, cross set battles here. So, kicking us off, Musky, you got the Sphere, Hatena, Rockruff, Shuppet, Cast Form. Caitlin Reverse and the Rillaboom Hollow Rare. Rillaboom Hollow Rare for Muskie. One, you need to score a hollow or higher here. One, also getting a chilling rain pack. One, what are we pulling tonight? One has come close, has not won yet, but he is a perennial player that's gotten pretty far before. Weedle with my boy Heracross. Getting Swirl. Cast Form. Quillfish. The Kecleon. And Scolopede. Musky. Moving on. One. He already down one. Down one. <laughs> we got the best jokes here. All night. Musky. Moving on. I think we're going to mix it up tonight. We're going to uh, pull both sides in tandem. So uh, the next one, we're going we're gonna to just, uh, we're going to zigzag tonight. Just to see. It's going to be the same packs, but it mixes up. And uh, if you see yourself on the right side, uh, then you at least can see yourself sooner. So Musky, open up the Fusion Strike.
Maybe the fusion strike got for you, Muskie. You got a quillfish. Tianamo, Meowth, Gossifer, Panpour, Phantop, and Muskie getting the Kangas Khan. The rapid strike, Kangas Khan. Zabadin, pulling the battle styles. All you need is a non hollow rare. Non hollow rare with greater than 120 HP. Let's see what you got. Parachurizu, Chirubi, Mawile, Onyx, Remoraid, Roly Coley, and the Victini V Max. Got the V Max. Here we go. You are moving on and. Honestly, getting one of the better hits, but not to worry. Battle styles. If you end up with that Oshifu V Max, you're gonna get the pick from the Alt Art pile. Here we go. Sleeve up. There you go, Zabadin. And Musky. There you go. Musky did not survive that one, but Zabadin. Zabadin making one and eight out of lemons. Okay, next up, going back to the left, Packy versus Lily. Okay, this is the bottom one. So that's Packy. And Lily. Pulling some battle styles. Let's go get those battle styles out of the way, and we can get to the. Uh, Evolving skies and brilliant stars and stuff. I, I mixed them up. Let's try to get the last we see battle stuff just for a little bit. Uh, Chilly Rain I put the most in just because of there's so many uh, alt arts in that. So, Packy, we got the Onyx, Bellsprout, Mr. Mime, Mean Fu, Timber, and Galarian Slowbro. So a non hollow with 130 HP. Pretty good. Not bad. There we go. And next up is Lily. Lily getting the battle styles. Really? You need an unhollow over 130. Remoraid, Fomantis, Mawile, Mankey, Horsey, Luxio, and the Galarian Slowbro. So, same exact rare. We're going to go to the reverse hollow slot. Where's that reverse hollow? We just had it. There we go. Luxio. With the 80. Timber <laughs> with the 80. Man, you guys are really testing this. Is why we have so many tiebreaker tiebreakers. Uh, so reverse slot. HP is tied. So we're going to go alphabetical order. Closest to A. Luxio wins. So that is Lily. Moving on. Packy. Packy with the Timber. Next up, Packy versus Juan. Okay, Packy getting the battle styles, man. We're just looking through. We're, get, we're getting rid of battle styles here real quick. Oh yeah, here we'll uh, we'll do this, and then I can go back over the uh, alt arts again. So Murkrow, Yamper, Galarian Slowpoke, Glamwow. Sizzlepeed, and this is Packy here under the Marsh Badge. Camping Gear, and the Victini V Full Art. Packy pulling the Full Art here, and then Juan with the Chilling Rain. You need the Full Art or better. Heracross, Clolopus, Grookey, Sneasel. Galarian Farfetch, Snow Run, and 
the Scoliopede one is one more closer to being eliminated. Packy getting the old Victini V. Full art. There you go, Packy. Good pickup. Okay. So, not only are we all sets with alt arts, uh, each set's going to have a corresponding bounty card. So, for instance, Brilliant Stars if you pull the Mimic UV Max, Chilling Rain if you pull, pull the Galarian Articuno V, Cinderace if you pull, or if you pull the Cinderace and Fusion Strike, Rapid Strike Urshifu, Fu in Battle Styles, Espeon in Evolving Skies. And the Radiant Greninja out of Astral Radiance. So if you pull one of these cards out of these sets, those are the representative from each of the sets that we're ripping tonight. You pull one of those, in addition to any of the alt arts that you can pull in the packs already, we have a stack of alt arts for everyone to pick from. So that's how that's going to work this evening. We're going to way back to the left. We got Barnes versus Zabadin. Barnes getting the fusion strike. Ooh, Zabadin. There you go. There's one of the evolving skies. He burnt through all the, uh, all of that. So, for instance, if Barnes here in the fusion strike pulls the Cinderace V, you're going to get uh, a pick out of the alt art. So, that makes sense otherwise we'll still apply on moving forward Clauncher Growlithe Stuffle Sigilith Toxel Toxtricity and Maractus Burns coming up with the non hollow 110 HP Zabadin a Rolling Skies pack there's always uh, the chance of pulling some C-note cards out of here. Evolving Skies, we got the Psyduck, the Rock and Rolla, Flabebe, Drowsy, Rufflet, Cryagonal, and the Smeargle for the rare. Oh. Burns and the Maractus moving forward. But I would take the Evolving Skies pack all day. The upside <laughs> is fantastic there. Next up, in his second battle, Discord 68. Got a nice Chilling Rain pack versus Tustin. He came back for this break. He was uh, a semifinalist. In, I believe, break number four, four or five. Discord 68. You're going to come up with a Blitzel, Ghastly, Coughing, Deli Bird, Galarian Farfetched, a Lucky Energy, and Galarian Wheezing. And yeah, next up, Testing, Eric. We need a non hollow greater than 130. We got a coughing. Shup it. Squove it. Sveal. Swirlix. Mareep. And the 170 Galarian. Woo! Eric. Moving on. It was a non hollow, but that was that was a non hollow. Whew. Galarian Weezing. Go to you. Discord 68. There you go. Testing, moving on. 
Next up, under the Cascade badge, Hamuzi versus Miss Muskie. Hamuzi getting the Brilliant Stars pack. And Miss Muskie getting Chilling Rain. Hamuzi, one of the Brilliant Stars. Who are we pulling Hamuzi? A Boizel. Halucha. Throw. Magmar, Staryu, Clefable, and the Muck. Non Hollow, 130 HP. Here we go. And next up, Miss Muskie. She's come close, but has never pulled off the win. And Mr. Muskie just pulled off his first victory last time. Can she make it to the finals? Venipede, Bound Sweep. A Lapras, Blitzel, Aaron, Snover, and for your rare, the Rebound Hollow, Miss Muskie, moving along in her first bout. Packy getting knocked out. Or Hamuzi, Hamuzi getting knocked out. Miss Muskie. Moving on. Okay, next we're going to go Burns versus Andy. Andy took it all, uh, I think, number five. Maybe four. Four was maybe that one. Because I know uh, Zabadin had those back-to-back -back wins in there. So Burns getting the chilly rain. Andy coming up with the fusion strike. Oh, my goodness. It's, it's almost done. It's... <laughs> I can't get rid of it though. You gotta let nature take its course. You just can't. Uh, you just can't rip it off. Burns coming up with the Clobopus, Grookey, Sneasel, Weedle, Farfetched, Dumtrio, and the Ampharos. Ampharos, one sixty. 160 HP, not bad. Burns might be uh, lumping out of this one. Andy, let me know if Fusion Strike has a non hollow with 160. We'll see though. Andy, what you got? You got the Totodile, the Baneri, the Clodopus, Tianamo, Zerua, Stuffle, and the Latios. You would think Latios would have more HP. 130. Weak. Weak sauce. Sorry, Andy. You're going to go down to Burns and Zampharos at 160. Burns just lumping along with the correct non holo rares. Okay. Halfway through the first round. We got Muskie moving forward along with Miss Muskie, Lily, and Burns. Uh, we got Burns again, but then we got Zabbat and Packy and Testin. So, good stuff thus far. We're going to get into that Lightning Badge, or Thunder Badge. We got Andy coming up with a Fusion Strike and the next one in here. Sorry. Muskie. Misread that. Muskie with the Fusion Strike. And then Andy is the next pack in line. Push these things forward. Yes, fusion strike. So it's gonna be a fusion strike versus fusion strike. Musky. What are we pulling here? I'm hoping we can pull some alt arts out of these. We got Drillbur, Bumblebee, Mudkip, Caterpie, Morpeko, Clefkey, and the Absol. I haven't pulled Fusion Strike in forever. I haven't seen any of this alt work in the longest time. We got an Absol here for Muskie. And Andy. Andy, how we doing? We got a Shinx. Shelmet. Drillber. Bunnelby. Eevee. Barascuda. And the Oracorio. 
Andy with the early Corio goes down to Muskie's Absol 100 versus 90. Muskie moving right along. And again, for anyone just joining us this evening, uh, we're up in a bevy of uh, Lult Art packs at the beginning here. We picked some chase cards here from one chase card from each set. So either a Mimikyu VMAX from Brilliant Stars, the Articuno V from Chilling Rain, the Cinderace from Fusion Strike, the Rapid Strike Urshifu VMAX from Battle Styles, the Espeon V from Evolving Skies, and the Radiant Greninja from of uh, Brilliant Stars. No, that's not Brilliant Stars. Astral Radiance. I always think that there's Radiance in Brilliant Stars. There aren't. Uh, so if you hit one of those bounty cards, we got choice of five alt arts ready to go. So even if you don't pull the alt art uh, in here, and for one of these packs, you could pull just one of the standard cards and win yourself an alt art here. Ah, so going next, uh, we're going to go with uh, Miss Muskie and Lily on the right. Yeah, we're going back and forth. Zoning out here. And now, I think we're going badge. I even forget how we're doing these things. So, oh my golly. Let's go with Zabadin and Tustin. Okay, we got a Battle Styles for Zabadin, and we got an Astral Radiance for Tustin. Zabadin, let's get some alt art. Let's get some Urshifu VMAX. We got the Pontiard. Cubone. Rumoraid. Philmantis. Galarian Slowpoke. Kingdra. Rapid <laughs> Strike Urshifu VMAX. There we go. Pulled the chase card. Let's settle the round here real quick and then we'll get to picking your alt art. Testing. You need a VMAX or better. Out of the Astral. Scyther. Togepi. Combi. Chata. Psyduck. Miltank. And the Hyssean Decidui V. So you're going to go down. You're going to get yourself a V though. Eric. You're going to get yourself a V. But unfortunately you're going to go down. To Zabadin. Who now gets to pick. An alt art. Do you want one, two, three, four, or five? We're doing it. Hey, they're all they're all good. Absolute metal, perfect. Ooh, you're gonna be happy with this one. You're gonna be happy with this one. We got the Ice Rider Calyrex Alt Art. You get all the Teddy Urses and Spheels and all the goodies. There you go. Calyrex V Alt Art. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Nice on the front. Nice on the back. We're not giving away Umbreon V Maxes, but we, we got a couple in the $20, $20, $30 range for the giveaways tonight. So, there you go. Paid out. 
congrats on pulling the Urshifu VMAX. It stays active. If there's another Urshifu VMAX out there, we're going to leave the bounty cards out there until all of these are gone and we're out of packs. So, Zabadin moved on. Oh, terrible handwriting. But, good enough. Now we're going to go over the Volcano Badge. Miss Muskie versus Lily. Miss Muskie is going to get the Fusion Strike. Lily, Evolving Skies. Miss Muskie, what can Fusion Strike do for you? We got a more Pekka. Eevee, Shoulder. Again, Fusion Strike. I don't even remember this Shoulder. Battle Styles is like burned into my brain. I ripped so much of that. But uh, Fusion Strike. Sometimes I get hit with a card I don't remember ever seeing. Sligo and the Vickerfold. Also another card I hardly ever remember seeing. I didn't rip a lot of Fusion Strike. I have a bunch just because of bulk buys and stuff. But I don't remember pulling it. Evolving Skies though. This is... I ripped quite a bit. So really... Really, what do you got here? We got Teddy Ursa, Malreep, Zorilla, Tentacool, Hopip, Drampa, and the Rayquaza VMAX. Really, there you go. This is one of the bangers out of Evolving Skies. Decent centering on that one. If you're going to pull a VMAX, that's... Uh, that's one you want to pull from that set for sure. Solid Evolving Skies pull. That's why people love Evolving Skies. There's so many hits in it that it's hard to get a good hit, but when you get a good hit, you get a good hit in that in that set. My good sir, there's not a, a bad high end hit in that set. So, really moving on. Miss Muskie. Better luck next time. Boom! Okay, next in the volcano is Hamuzi and Juan. Oh, now the white one's being persnickety. There we go. Chilling rain for Hamuzi. Fusion Strike for one. Hamuzi. Oh, this is a lucky one. This one, like, is extra glued down. There we go. These are all authentic packs. 100%. <laughs> I don't know why this one's so glued, though. Looks like it was extra run through the ringer. Ugh. And it was in backwards. Great. Waltz. Heracross, automatic winner. No, just joking. <laughs> it should be. Cast form, Sphiel, Hatena, Bounce Suite, and a Zangoose. When are they going to give me an, a Heracross alt art? If there's a Heracross alt art, I will buy unlimited copies of it. They need to give me one. Or a uh, Heracross character rare. They should be uh, doing one of those, considering that Hop has a Heracross. Or not Hop, um, Go. Go in the anime has a Heracross. And Ash has a Heracross. Why do they not give me Heracross alt arts? Why do they tease me so? Juan, you need a rare over 110 HP. Ruru, Gossifler, Mudkip, Sandshrew, Pukey Mookie, and give it all 130 give it you all one with his last spot moving on one moving on hamuzi down a slot one there we go. Next up, Discord 68 on the left side with the rainbow badge. Discord 68, you're going to get yourself an Astral Radiance. And a Willy Fusion Strike. 
Discord 68, you're gonna be pulling. We got a Basculin, Pochiana, Glamio, Yanma, Swinub, Cricketot, and the Registeel. Registeel for Discord 68. Really? Go to the Fusion Strike. Fusion Strike has that gorgeous Espeon alt art. It would be fantastic if we could pull ourselves one of those. Daramaka, Invidi, Growlithe, Phalanx, Meryl, and the Meloetta, 90 HP. Meloetta, really going down. Discord 68, moving on with the Registeel. Just picked up uh, Pokemon Go again. We downloaded it, started digging through all the old Pokemon. Every so often I do a little reset. I kind of get tired with it and I uh, go away for a year or two. Uh, and then I come back and then I have no idea how uh, how any of the new game mechanics work. Uh, specifically, they got rid of XL and X, extra small and extra large weight. Uh, I used to save a lot of Pokemon. <laughs> that was like the largest and smallest specimen. I thought that was cool. They got rid of that, so that's not as fun anymore. Uh, next up for the rainbow, rainbow badge here on the left is Hamuzi and Miss Muskie. Hamuzi getting the battle styles. Miss Muskie getting the fusion strike. Both of these could pay. As we saw earlier with Zabadon. The battle styles paid out a gorgeous alt art. We got the Glammeow, the Tepig, Timber, Pontiard, Cacnea, Camping Gear, and Hamuzi's rare slot. With Sherem Hollow, not a lot of HP, but you get out of that rare, rare slot slog, uh, you got a good shot around these parts, as we've seen time and time again. Just getting something higher than a rare is more than enough to get you through. Miss Muskie with the fusion. Trubbish, Totodile, Phantom, Snorlax, Skitty, and the Huntail. Huntail, not hollow. Hamuzi. Moving on with your little Battle Styles charm. Hamuzi, moving on. Miss Muskie. Down another slot. Damn. Okay, and to finish out the first round here, the Earth Badge. We got Don. Don, you're going to get an Astral Radiance. And next out is Testin with the Chilling Rain Pack. Missed you the past few. Appreciate you coming back. And then next month is Lost Origin release week break. So bring your appetite for some Giratina. Hey, Don. Hey, yo, it's Don. In the chat, Stantler, Birdmite, Hepatita, Hepata, Cyndaquil, Scyther, Waltz, and Don, your rare slot, the Reggie Drago. 130. Not a bad rare. If you're going to get something that's not hollow, anything in the hundreds is good. Testing with the Chilling Rain Pack. We've got a Mareep. Heracross. Clavipus. Grookey. Sneasel. Cast Form. And the Sazbuck. Don, you're moving on. Don's moving on with the 130 Reggie Drago. Testing. Getting knocked out on that one. Don, thanks for jumping on. So, uh, as mentioned a few times, we're ripping a mix. If it has an alt art in it, we're ripping it. Fusion Strike, Battle Styles, Evolving Skies. Chilling Rain, uh, Brilliant Stars, and Astral Radiance is a mix of those packs in here. Uh, not only can you pull all arts from all of those sets, 
We also have some bounty cards here. So, for if I could get some of them, some assemblance of order here. Uh, battle styles of all these guys. Fusion strike. Okay, cool. If you pull one of these cards from these set packs, so a Rapid Strike Urshifu V Max, a Galarian Articuno V, Espeon V, Cinderace V, Mimikyu V Max, or Radiant Greninja from their corresponding sets. You will then get to pick from the pile of alt arts. Uh, most of them are in the $20 to $30 range. Uh, and Zabadin pulled that Urshifu VMAX from a Battle Styles pack and won himself a Ice Rider Calyrex alt art. So, good luck. Good luck to either getting a alt art directly out of your pack or pulling one of these bounty cards. So, next up, Burns versus Packy. Burns, you're getting Chilling Rain. Packy, Brilliant Stars. Burns, first up. We got a Clobfus. Grookey, Sneasel, Sveal, Weedle, Galarian Chestplate, and Slurpuff. Surpuff for the 110. Packy, you just need a non hollow greater than 110 HP. Can you do that from the Brilliant Stars? Packy, you got a Turtwig. Mincino, Carablast, Bweasel, Halucha, Nosepass, and a Clefable. Barnes is moving on. By 10 HP. Slurpuff to Clefable. Packy, there you go. Burns. There you go. Burns is moving on. Everybody has at least made advanced one of their slots to the next round. Very exciting stuff. Okay, so through the first round, we got Musky, Lily, Burns, Miss Musky, Musky again, Zabadin, Discord 68, and Hamozi. On the right side, we got Zabadin, Packy, Testin, Burns, Lily, Juan, Don. And Burns. Lots of names. Lots of familiar names through here through the first round. We paid out one alt art. Gonna guess we're probably gonna pay out about one more, or somebody's gonna pull one here on the back half. Back nine here. So let's go. Okay, first up, Musky versus Lily. Musky with the fusion strike. We got a Q-Fant, Infidim, Snom, Onyx, Jigglypuff, Arachnid, and a Yevidol. Yevidol from Fusion Strike. Second time we've seen that one. 130 HP. Decent HP. Really? Can you pull something higher than a non hollow rare? We got a Choodle, Volaby, Dupider, Meowth, Onyx, Snom, and a Cloister. Oh, we got a Tiebreaker on HP. So, we need to go to, uh, we got a alphabetical, sorry, completely blank there. <laughs> I, think, I think the muskies have been getting a lot of fusions. I think Zabbat has only been getting battle styles. <laughs> so, uh, Cloister, 
finally is moving forward with the letter C versus Yevidal at Y. Maybe Exernius would have been the only one worse than that. Lily, slide forward. We got some good stuff coming through. So Lily taking the boulder badge this time for number eight. Um, so we're gonna do we're gonna finish up this side of the bracket, just the first two, and then we'll we'll switch over to the other side. So it's Burns versus Miss Muskie. Burns taking the astral. Miss Muskie, can you take? Yeah, you 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 got it. You got the chilling rain. You broke the fusion strike cycle. The cycle of fusion strike violence. Astral. Astral Radiance for Mr. Burns here. Smithers, bring the car around. I'm feeling a hit. Togepi. Chadot. Magnemite. Teddy Ursa. Sneezel. Driftworm. And the Ursa Luna. Ursa Luna non hollow. Coming in at a strong 180. Strong, strong 180 for Burns. Miss Rusky, got the chilling rain. I would suggest getting something better than a rare against that bear. Heracross, that should be an auto win right there. Cast form, Sphiel, Hatena, Rockruff, Shaman, and the Galarian Weezing non hollow. Burns. Going through with that bear. That's a bear of a card. Ursalina. Miss Muskie. There's your delirium wheezing. You didn't get the fusion and it still didn't help, unfortunately, <laughs> for this evening. But uh, no, I think that was Miss Muskie's last hurrah at the OK Corral this evening. We'll package you up. Miss Muskie, best luck. You've had a hot hand uh, many a times. This one may not have been the hottest of nights, but the old man's still alive. Might be able to bring home bring home some uh, bacon like he did last time. Okay, next up, let's go to the Marsh Badge. Let's see these badges out of order. Let me script some people's OCD. Zabadin. Oh! Zabadon getting the Evolving Skies. Spicy Evolving Skies. We saw how spicy it can be. And Packy with the Battle Styles. Zabadon. What are we going to pull here? What are we going to pull here? Zabadon, you got a Feebass. Dodging them hooks. They're about to toss. Lillipop. Nick it. Nick it night. Bird bite. Gorgeist. And a Seismitoad. 170. Whew. Some big non hollows out here in some of these sets. We haven't ripped them forever. I think some of these were still when we used to do the uh, the money, the value. I don't remember some of these, like, some of these high digit ones. Seismitoad. Solid hit to move on. Keep yourself alive. Packy, the battle styles, but get that Urshifu V Max, you're gonna get yourself a Alt Art. Pirachorizu, Minfu, Paltoy, Mr. Mime, Fomantis, Drampa, and you need a non hollow higher than 170. A Concaliber, 160. Packy, getting bounced. Zabadin, keeping his night alive. Oh, I forgot to advance the camera as well. There we go. Camera advanced. Packy goes down. That is Packy's last spot of the evening. Packing it up. After a strong showing up front. Strong showing up front, though. You got a couple uh, couple goodies coming your way, including the Victini V Full Art. So congrats on that one.
Oh, doesn't like that. It's fine. And then anyone jumping in next break, we're going to be breaking during Lost Origin Open Weekend or uh, Launch Weekend. So we're going to be launching all kinds of Lost Origin, ripping the newest set here. Next up, Testin versus Burns. We got Testin with the Battle Styles. Burns with the Battle Styles. I think Battle Styles is done. You guys really pulled that early. So. Battle Styles going to Testin. We got a Yamper. Galarian Slowpoke. Glam Meow. Sizzle P. Onyx. Heatmore. And the Tyranitar V. That was one of the other options for. Uh, when we were picking the bounty cards. So, but this does not pay. You need the Urshifu Rapid Strike. But, the T-Tar V for testing. That might get you through to the next round here. Eric! Eric Burns! Can you beat Eric's T-Tar V? Foolish. Cubone. Zubat. Spiro, Fomantis, Galarian Slowbro, and the Single Strike Urshifu VMAX Full Art. Man, Battle Styles might not be the best pack, but it is slapping tonight. <laughs> we had like two Full Arts, some Vs, a VMAX. We haven't pulled an Alt Art though. Barnes, moving on with a Full Art. Burns moving on. Testing. Eric. I think that might be your night. Let me just double check that. There you go, Eric. Uh, that is it. That is it for you, sir. But you had a couple uh, a couple hits tonight. You had the Decidueye V and the Tyranitar V. So... There you go. Keep your head up, and you still have an opportunity at the, uh, the Wheel of Names later this evening. So stick around. Testing out. Burns. Burns. Moving on. Going back to the left side, we got Musky versus Zabadin. Muskie with the Battle Styles and Zabadin with the Astral. Muskie looking for that VMAX. I mean, these things have been hot, though. You might actually pull an alt art. I don't know what's up with these the Battle Styles. Cherubi, Horsey, Murkrow, Bronzer, Bellsprout, Karina's Focus, and the Bronzong Hollow. Zabadin with the Astral. Zabadin with the Astral coming out with a Drifloon, Psyduck, Togepi, Magnemite, Waltz, Magnazone, and the Reggie Alecki Non Hollow Muskie. Doing work with the Hollow. Muskie, moving on. Zabadin, knocked out with the old Regieleki. Next up, Discord 68 versus Hamuzi. Discord 68 and Hamuzi. Up next, Discord 68. What are you pulling? We got a Mawile, Cacnea, Corefish, Timber, Ball Toy, Camping Gear, 
and a Crobat Hollow. We have Discord 68. And next up, Hamozy. The Hamozy show with the fusion strike. Strike and fear. We got a cluck key. Pan Sage. Arulo. Pancham. Dadamaka. Zoark. And you need a hollow over 130 HP. The Maractus non hollow. Hamozy. I think that's it. I think you're packing up for the evening. Hamuzi getting knocked out by Discord 68 with the Crobat. Discord 68 moving forward on that side. Hamuzi it was a good evening, sir. You ended up with the Chalubi Hollow. <laughs> That was the that was the the big hit out of that side. There we go. And Zabadin, you're still around. Lily Burns. One. Oh, I think Andy might be out. Andy. Sorry, my friend. I think you got knocked out pretty early on. Yep, Andy was gone. Just clean up the old area. Lily Lawn Burns, Zabadin, Musky Dawn, and Discord. Still moving right along. Next up, for the Volcano Badge, we got Lily versus Lawn. Lily with the Evolving Skies, and Ron with the Brilliant Stars. Here we go. Lily already had one Evolving Skies. Murdered it. Murdered it with the Rayquaza VMAX. Can we put any more Evolving Skies fire? We got Pikachu, Pumpkaboo, Rufflet, Lotad, Amoga, Cutify, and a Talonflame. 140 HP, that's decent. Could keep you, could keep you alive here. And one. One with the brilliant stars. Can we see a Charizard all dark tank? That'd be great. One, we got the Gibble, Trap Pinch, Execute, Starly, Shroomish, Carablast, and the Tornado Slowly. Moving on with the Talon Flame. Somehow a large red bird is stronger than a literal god. I don't know how. But Lily, <laughs> moving on. One out. One. Sorry, rolls don't work here like uh, it would with anywhere else. One, that is your evening, sir. You had the Tornadus, you had some reverses, not to worry, sir. Lost Origin, I'm sure, is going to treat folks much better. Uh, next up, Dawn and Burns. Dawn, you're getting yourself a Brilliant Stars. Burns. Yep, yeah, that's the bottom one. No, it isn't. I thought there was one more in there. There we go. Astral. We got Don with the Brilliant Stars, Burns with the Astral. Don, where are we pulling? We got a Grimer, Sneasel, Beedoof, Electabuzz, Chimeco, Farfetched, and the Wernadom. Wernadom 110. Next up, we got Burns. Burns with the Astro. We got a Bergmite, Hippodotas, Cyndaquil, Scyther, Growlithe, Switch Cart, and you need a non hollow higher than 110. The Bravery at 130. Burns. 
turns, moving on. Bon, your night comes to an end, but no worries. Still have the roll off or the uh, the wheel at the end, but you could still get yourself a spot in the end of year giveaway, in which we got 60 spots, 30 from the first half that carry over, plus whatever spots people get here in the back end. Burns with the braviary. There you go. We are now down to our final eight. Oh. Final eight, we got Lily, Burns, Muskie, Discord 68, and Zabadin. Burns, I've drawn all three. But as we know, three spots in the final eight is not always safe. Uh, I think only one person has ever taken the whole thing with three spots at this point. Others have met their doom when it's come down to the final eight. So first up, the Lily and Burns. Lily with the Astral. We pulled some all arts. We pulled some V Maxes. We pulled some Vs. Haven't pulled a secret yet, though. Or a full art. So let's let's get some action here on the back end. Basculin, Wolpurb, Glam Meow, Swinub, Chatot, Grant, and the Vespa Queen, Non Hollow, for 120 HP. Burns, you need something higher than 120 HP. Can you do it? Can you do it? Is this going to be the first to go down of many? Venipede, Snover, Slowpoke, Crabrawler, Snow Run, Brawly, in the Spirit Tomb. Put your first spot in the grave. Spirit Tomb at 70 HP, just getting smoked by the Vespa Queen. Burns, you're down a spot. Lily, moving on. Lily also has two spots. Next up, Muskie versus 68. Muskie hanging on. Chip chairing a prayer here. The Muskie feeling getting the fusion strike. And Discord 68. Grabbing yourself an evolving skies. Here you go. Muskie, what can you pull here? We got a Durant, a Panseer, Minon, Baltoy, Corsola, Farewell Bell, and a Cloister for 130 HP. Discord 68. Are you going to pull something with a higher than 130 HP? Are you going to pull a $350 Umbreon VMAX? The world may never know. But we're going to figure that out. Dwebble, Hippodotas, Zerula, Psyduck, Rufflet, Spirit Mask, and a Gorgeist. No, Discord 68 goes down to Muskie. Muskie, limping along with that 130 Cloister. Discord 68. Thanks again for repeating out here again. Feel free to stick around. We got uh, the Wheel of Dames coming up here at the end where you can get yourself a spot into the end of your break. Uh, I'm pretty certain by the next end of your break, I can start revealing some of the prizes uh, that are coming up there. Uh, one of them is going to be a booster box. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out which one. It's going to be a good one, though. Uh, and it's probably not going to be Sword and Shield block. So... A little hint there on that one. So that's it's probably going to be one of the bigger prizes. We're going to try to get another Charizard out here too. Another uh, base set Charizard uh, for the giveaway. So we're going to check that out. Next up this evening, we got Zabadin versus Burns in the final eight. This is Burns' second go. Zabadin with the Chilling Rain. Hoo-hoo. <laughs> Frigid. And back-to-back -back Chilling Rains. Can we get something out of here? Can we get uh, 
Zavadin's Ice Rider. It's a little lonely. A little lonely. I think Zavadin wants the uh, the Shadow Ice Rider. We could uh, have the team. The whole team's here. Go what? Dealing. Sneasel. Galarian Farfetch'd. The Furfru. Go what? In a Frostlass Hollow. Not a lot of HP, but you got a hollow. You got all that nine. You're not going to get beat out by a bear or a bird or something. I mean, you still could. But they'd have to be a hollow. Burns. Is this going to be two down for you tonight? Are you going to get one through? Yeah, mask. Coughing. Shup it. Squib it. Speedle. Willipede, and you need a hollow. The Agron. Oh, it's a good thing we didn't have a non hollow Zabadin. That was a 180 non hollow. That is that is aggressive. Uh, but Burns. Burns have been burned on two spots. Zabadin moving forward with the hollow. Zabbin and Burns on the strict burn notice. And Lily versus Burns. Can Burns get his uh, get it together here and make it through? I told you the the three spots in the, the, the Elite Eight is cursed. It's cursed. I think only one person's ever won. So chilling rain for Lily. Burns gets the battle styles. The battle styles has been literally the hottest set tonight. Most battle style packs have netted something of of interest. We got a Crab Waller for Lily. We got a Grookey, Score Bunny, Aaron, Snow Runt, Cast Form, and for Lily, the Pan Simeon 110. It's pretty middle of the road. Pretty middle of the road there. Not hollow. 110 could make it. Burns could uh <laughs> Pull himself like an art art or something out of the, the battle styles. You, you don't know. You'd never know. We got Spoink. Cacnea. Bronzer. Salandit. Gliger. Lickitung. And we need a non hollow higher than 110. We got the Licka Licky. Licka Licky. We got the double licks. Just getting his licks, son. Burns. Moving on. Burns got one through. I was, uh, I was worried. I was worried there for a hot second. Concerned, I guess, is more, that's the more accurate statement. I was concerned. There we go. Okay. Really, unfortunately, that's down, but. We got four different folks in for the finals here. Before the finals, we got Lily, Muskie, Zabadin, and Burns. Uh, I think... I know Muskie and Zabadin have won. Zabadin was a double. I don't think Burns has ever won, and I don't believe Lily's ever won. So, but we got a bunch of veterans here. Let's see what we can pull. We're getting into the final packs here. Lily getting the Astral. Muskie getting the Battle Styles. And then over here. Zabadin getting the Chilling Rain. And Burns getting the Battle Styles. So Lily, first up, Astral. with the Magnemite, Waltz, Sneasel, Mysterious, Barboach, Zashian V for Lily, and the Typhlosion Hollow. That's a nice uh, character rare. We're not paying out on character rares. That's just, uh, it's just a nice bonus. 
Got a nice character rare there. I don't think I've ever seen the, the Zashian with Hop. That's uh, that's pretty solid. Pretty solid, man. We'll, uh, let's get her sleeved up here. Whoop. And the Typhlosion. So you got the Hollow. The really musky with the battle styles. You need a hollow. We got the Galarian Slowpoke, Mankey, Horsey, Chimeco, Honedge, Single Strike Energy, and oh, I think Muskie's going to the finals. Single Strike Style Mustard. The battle styles were fierce. Oh no! It's got like a paint error on it. What is that? Oh no, it doesn't. That's supposed to be like that. I haven't seen that car in forever. You're good. I was worried, but there's other stuff that breaks the border here. You're good. You're good. Sorry if I made you sweat. I thought that was a. Uh, it's like a really weird spec that they put there on the end, but that's actually how it is. But musky. Moving on. And you got yourself a full wire. There you go, musky. Moving along. Really? You got yourself the Zashian V. And we're going to keep your hollow out here. We're going to figure out who's in third. And who's in fourth? Muskie. And now we got Zabadin versus Barnes. Zabadin's got the Chilling Rain pack here. Zabadin with the Venipede. Steel, Crabrawler, Golet, Porygon, Galarian Slowpoke, and the Galarian Weezing. 130. Pretty good. Pretty good. Are we going to have a rematch of, I think, the past two winners? I don't think Zabadin won two ago. I think he maybe won three ago. You can, you can correct me. I know you had quite a few wins there in a, in a row. And Burns. With the battle styles, which has somehow been the best set this evening. Crazy. Uh, Gligar, Shinx, Houndor, Pontiard, Cubone, Tepig, and a Stoutland V. Burns making it to the finals. Chilling pain. Claims another victim. But you did get the all art, so that wasn't terrible. Uh, Stoutland V, now that wasn't one of the Burns, I think, for the second time. You've been in the finals before, Burns. Um, and then third and fourth, so Lily is going to take third. Zabadin is going to take fourth, but Zabadin's here. So do you want. <laughs> <laughs> Not to add in, so do you want the left or right uh, Chilling Rain pack? Do you want the Zapdos or the Moltres? Right? Okay. Moltres, correct? I want to make sure it isn't flipping, <laughs> flipping stuff around. Do you want the Moltres? Yes. Cool. Let's rip it right here. Come on, get, let's get that shadow. Let's get the shadow. Coughing. Deli Bird. Glaring Far Fetched. Porygon. Heracross. Coughing. And. Oh! Fog Crystal! There we go. That was a good, good choice. Excellent choice. 
got yourself a fog crystal. A little off center, but I don't know how many people are getting a fog crystal graded. Still would look fantastic in a binder. There you go. Picked. Definitely picked the correct one. So, I mean, you got some stuff to go home with tonight for certain. You got the. Just toss these on the pile. Throw the these shrimps on the body. You got a couple of VMAXs. And you, you probably got at least two cards for your uh, Chilling Rain binder. The Chilling Rain, like, secret rares and ultra rares is insane. I had like a pile of, like, 20 and then I put it in a binder and realized there was, like, 60 of them. So, that's. <laughs> That's fantastic. So you got yourself a gold and an alt art. So that's nice. But yeah, I feel your pain. Chilling Rain is just like a slog. There's so many hits in Chilling Rain. And it's not like uh, Evolving Skies where you can like make shit up by like pulling a 300 card, 300 dollar card, or 200 dollar card, and be like, well, at least there's that. Like Chilling Rain cards aren't like the most expensive to be just straight up ripping piles of them so here we go we'll just so always nice to get some singles that you need there we go we'll stick you right over here in the lily clear prize you got the Garuki score bunny Aaron Snow Runt Venipede Sneasel in the Galarian Articuno V. That is the prizes. You know what? I am going, you know, this is one of the chase cards. I didn't say that the prizes counted, but I think uh, I think I'll make the prizes count. So that goes for first, second, and third. If uh, or second and uh, first and second, whatever packs you get, if uh, if you get it, I'll, I'll count the bounties. So here I'll mix them up. And uh, Matt, you got four letters in your name, so we'll pick number four for you. We'll get we'll get you an alt art here to go home with. You got the single strike Urshifu V alt art. There you go, Matt. Let you walk home with an alt art this evening, along with a nice Galarian Articuno V. Matt, you also, I think you were, had one of the better pulls this evening with the Rayquaza V Max. That was our best Evolving Skies pull, so there you go. And uh, yeah, for second and third, if you happen to pull, or first and second, if you happen to pull any of the bounty cards in your prize packs, I'll, I'll give you. I'll give you the chance to pull from that pile. So, uh, we're going down. Final countdown. Musky versus Burns. Musky, this should be our last pack. It is. Burns. <laughs> last pack. Last pack magic. Musky, where are you pulling? We're either walking out with Brilliant Stars packs or Evolving Skies packs. Musky getting the Hound Door. Lick it tongue. Sizzlepeed, Shinx, Cacnea, Lickitung, and a Jellicent in the final. Musky, 120, non hollow. Burns. Burns has never won. So can Musky make it a two peat? Or is Burns going to take home his first title? Here, we'll do. Uh, We'll do the pack trick. Squirrel Swirls. Pig Knight. Dublade. Flamantis. Stolpoke. Mankey. Horsey. Chimeco. Bell Sprout. And. Is Muskie walking in with five evolving skies or three brilliant stars? Burns. 
has the Galarian Mr. Rhyme Musky going for back to back wins. Burns. Always the bridesmaid, never the bride. Musky, here you go. Musky is our winner. Back to back. Musky has now won back to back. And one of our two time winners now joining Zabadin. So here we go. Burns, you get your brilliant stars. Let's see what we can get out of these. Your brilliant stars uh, bounty is the Mimikyu VMAX. So if you pull one of those, we'll give you a pick on one of the alt arts. We got Staryu, Carablast, Clefairy, Cherubi, Sock, a Gold Urshifu VMAX. There you go, Burns. And a Flygon. There we go. That's a excellent character rare. I'm excited for the next ones. I think it's Pikachu and Mew in Lost Origins. So we're going to get the next round of these. I like these golds. These are really nice. Burns, next pack. Can we get ourselves a Charizard VMAX here? That would be fantastic. If we could do one of those. We got a Carablast, Clefairy, Cherubi, Sock, Corefish, Axu, and a Mag Mortar. And Burns' is final pack. Cherubi, Rolo, Starly, Spiritomb, Purloin, Mewtwo, and another Flygon. So Burns ended up with a gold. Congrats, Burns. I don't, uh, I think you had a couple of these in there. Oh yeah, you had a full art. You'd go to Urshifu, mate. Lots of Urshifus for Burns. There we go. And what everyone was wondering, can somebody pull an alt art from Evolving Skies? So musky, here we go. So we're uh, keeping track. These booster boxes have jumped to like 175, 180. So I don't think the reprint did much. It was hard to get some. I got uh, some, but you had to like buy a whole bunch of stuff. So now I have multiple cases of Pokemon Go uh, theme decks. <laughs> <laughs> that I don't know what to do with, but it is important. I got my uh, I got my evolving skies booster boxes, a Moga, Dino, and a Flapple. I really uh, I hope my Costco gets those ETBs because I do want to rip some more evolving skies. We got an Eevee. Cutie Fly, Pikachu, Applin, Willipup, Wilbat, and the Milotic. Okay, and let's get our little. Oh, here it is. Like, where's my knife? Here's my knife. Pack arts we get Sylveon, Umbreon, and a Duraludon. Okay, let's go Sylveon. Can we get one of these amazing alt arts out of here? We got a Tentacool, Hoppip, Bagon, Wilbafet, Litleo, Gordy, and a Sharpedo. Let's open up the Duraludon. I know it's the uh, the non-exciting one. It's the pack art that no one likes. There's always the, that one pack art that nobody likes. <laughs> Let's see. Sometimes those are the fire things. That was like the Whimsicott for Brilliant Stars. I got all my best hits out of Whimsicott packs. Lotad, Sableye, Teddy Ursa, Mareep, Zorua, Sharpedo, and an Appleton. There's really no hits. This is the problem with Evolving Skies. Evolving Skies is the most gambly set ever. 
because it still is wears over like 300 bucks, but then you can't like hit shit no matter how much you see people rip like 80 packs and get like a Gyarados VMAX. So we got a Gossifler. Actually, let's do the pack trick. Since it's the final pack of the night, we got an Avalug. Switching Cups. Tentacruel. Gossifler. Feebass. Hippotatos. Lollipop. Nicket. Galarian Articuno. And for your rare, which if you pull an SPR V, you'll get an alt art. Or you could just get an alt art here. The Sylveon V, so close. So you ended up did you did end up getting a V out of that. So you got the Sylveon. Uh not a bad night, Muskie though. You are now a two time winner. Getting some exclusive status amongst the Chicago Discord. You can join Zabadin on the Discord Hall of Fame. Uh, in addition, you got yourself a full art. You got yourself some mustard, and I think there's a V in there. I think you got a V at some point. Maybe not. Either way, here you go. We'll get you your Evolving Skies. You can sell those codes for like 25 cents a piece. People love the Evolving Skies codes. So, there we go. That closes it out. Musky getting there. We're going to pull up the wheel of names here. Oh, let me uh, switch the old camera around so I can make sure that stuff is in the focus here. Okay, there we go. Uh, Musky, if you're in chat, could you give me a number between one and five? Just a number between one and five, Musky, if you're still in chat. And if not, Zabadin, if you're in chat, just toss a number one to five. Oh, four, Musky. Got the four. Okay, let's shuffle her four times. One, two, three, and four. That and thanks for the backup. <laughs> the backup thing. So let me get uh, a piece of paper so I can write this down. Where's all my, oh, there it is. Gotta get my Urshifu notebooks out and about. Okay. So, Muskie, you got yourself another spot in the end of year. Who else is going to join you for this from this evening? Burns! Remove. Burns! You're moving to the end of the year. Burns! Burns getting two slots. Shit, man, you didn't win, but... You're doing, you're doing good work here. Number three... Looks like if Burns gets to get it. <laughs> Testing. And for our last go of the night. One. So that makes our winners tonight. Musky, Burns, Burns again, and Testin and Warren. That is, that's going to conclude break number eight. So next time that we get together, my friends, we're going to be breaking Lost Origin. 
Uh, I'm figuring out what the gimmick's going to be. I might give away an ETB to the winner or something like that. So keep your eyes peeled. Uh, we're going to be doing Lost Origin, though. Uh, break week, uh, what is it, release weekend. Uh, I think that's two weeks from now. So we're going to work to do that release weekend or sometime around that, uh, either the Friday or Saturday. So... Thanks, everyone, uh, for coming out. Thanks, Smusky. Thanks, Sabadin, for still being in chat. Appreciate it all, and I uh, hope you all have a great evening. And uh, stay safe out there, and enjoy the rest of your summer here as it winds down. Thanks again.